Okay, we want to give some direction on using the star and planet locator. And first I'll just notice two main things. You've got a, a light blue sort of frame area that's fixed and then there's a movable wheel that has the stars drawn on it. Uh, that's a darker shade of blue. On the light bl blue frame, there is a 24 hour clock that starts at midnight, 1 a.m., around to 6 a.m. and then to noon, and then 1 p.m., 2 p.m., all the way to 6 p.m., 7, 8, 9 p.m., 10, 11, 12, back to midnight like that. On the wheel, there is a calendar. It has the months and the days of the months. Here you see December 5th, December 10th, December 15th, like that. It goes all the way through the whole year. And when you set the day of the month, uh, at a particular time, then this window here shows what will be up in the sky at uh, that time on that particular day. So to start with, we're going to set the uh, the wheel to indicate January 1st at 9 p.m. So here's 9 p.m. I'm going to turn the wheel until January 1st is lined up with the 9 p.m. mark. Right there, there's January 1st and 9 p.m. And then this whole dark blue opening here, what you see in that dark blue opening is the entire sky as you would see it on the 1st of January at 9 o'clock at night. The edge of the opening represents your horizon all in, in all directions. The very center of the opening represents what would be straight overhead in the middle of the sky. And you can see here on January 1st at 9 p.m. what would be straight overhead would be the constellation Perseus. The uh, brad here that everything turns around is the North Celestial Pole and there's a little note that Polaris right on the North Celestial Pole sits right there. Stop it.